doing? Ah, uh, looking for my glasses. So? Well, I can't see without them, Candace. Well, the show's about to start. Can you fake it? I guess I'll have to. Okay, let's go. Come okay, on. Okay, here we go. Brent, it's this way. Okay. <sighs> okay. Ooh, ice cream. Uh, actually, <laughs> that's a... That's uh, the oh, is it the door? Oh. No, no, that's wet sign oh, okay. paint. Oof. Oh, my glasses! My glasses! Dude, those are definitely not your glasses. Oh, they're gonna have to do, Candace. <gasps> okay. Okay, let's go. Brent, Perfect. this way. Oh. Okay. Live from Ubik Square in the heart of New York City, it's Ubik Live. I'm saying that. This way. Stay here. Okay. Hello, and thanks for visiting the planet of plentiful picking. This is Ubik Live. I'm Candace. Brent. What's your wine? Yeah, I got nothing. Okay, and this is Brent, and we have got a great show for you guys today. Chock full of your favorite picks. I can't see anything! Hey, um, well... What seems to be a problem here, guys? Hey, this is the producer, Jonathan, and... Hey! hey. You're wearing Brent's glasses! Oh, whoops. Here's your glasses, Brent. Where? Bad, here. Brent. Oh, Over what? here. Oh, Over here. oh, cool. Um, oh, those must be, must be your glasses. Oh, Sweet. now I can see again. Great. Woo, let's see what's going on in today's show. Good idea. Check oh, it out. At 4.14, we've got rap star Murphy Lee coming by to hang out. At 4.30, we will find out today's Nick.com pick, followed by it came from the message board at 5, and then at 6, two Nicktoons collide Woo. for the head-to-head -head pick. Now here's the little fairly odd parents on You Pick Live. I'm so glad you got the glasses. Yeah. What was that? Was that? that was not pink. That was it's gross like too. The yeah. loose thingy, whatever. Hey, on Live. Right now we are taking some time to hang out with hip hop artist Murphy Lee. Thank you for Oh, of course. So you've worked with a lot of successful rappers and singers. Yeah. Who's someone that you'd really like to work with next? Um, probably like Outkast or Lauryn Hill. Outkast would be fun. Like that. <laughs> yeah, that's what's up. Which do you like better, going on tour or recording in the studio? Um, they all one. It's one big thing, so I, I can't you don't, decide. You would rather like perform in front yeah, of the people, or I like going to the studio and then going, being able to go perform for them. You know, so fun. it's all in one. So what's something that maybe your biggest fans would need to know about you? <laughs> Um, I'm a vegetarian. Are you? Yeah. No meat. No meat. Wow. How long? No meat. About four years now. Oh, yeah. I couldn't do it. <laughs> I just couldn't. So, with your busy schedule, uh, do you still have time to play sports? Because I know you're a sports fan. Um, <laughs> mostly on the PlayStation or something like that, but. Um, we, we play basketball when we can or something yeah. like that. Yeah. So you still get a little time every now and then? Every once in a while, but not really. Okay. Um, uh, Brent has a couple of Nick.com questions for you. Um, this is from uh, Star Fox Arm. <laughs> Have you ever messed up on your own rhyme while a crowd is watching you? That's a good um, question. I want to say all the time. <laughs> 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 We've been doing a lot of, we got a lot of records out and, and a lot of material, so I forget sometimes, but they usually help me get right back. So, so what do you do? Do you freestyle in that situation? No, I kind of be quiet and let the crowd get uh, me back where I'm supposed to be. Hold on the mic. It's awesome. your turn. <laughs> they never awesome. know. They never know. Here's now. another question. It's from Lucky Cat G. How old were you when you started rapping? Um, I probably was like eight, eight years old, you know what I mean? Probably like... Maybe 11 years ago. And were you, were you doing like, uh, were, you, were you like composing or were you just freestyling? Um, I was trying to write. I was trying to write. She just asked me that too. I was trying <laughs> to write, you know, but that's most right. time it's freestyle though. Yeah, cool. right. Okay, we are going to take a break, but when we come back, Murphy Lee will be having a little round of this or that with Bricks. <laughs> just stick around. You Pick Live is brought to you by. Yeah, you're watching your big live. I'm hanging out with Murphy Lee. Uh, and uh, Murphy, you know what time it is? What time is it? It's time for this or that. Okay. Yeah, so it's not time to go home. It's not time for tea. It's uh, time for this or that. You know how this works? Um, a little bit. Okay, a little bit. yeah, I'm going to explain it to you so you know all the way. All right. I'm going to give you two things. Don't think, just answer. Got it? Got it. Good. Start the music. Murphy's Law or Lobster Claw? Murphy's Law. Murphy's Law, of course. Whoa, that one went flying. Hip hop or hula hoop? Hip hop. Hip hop, of course. Hula hoop went out in the 70s. St. Louis or St. Lunatics? Both. Both. But you got it. Oh, all right, I'll give it to you. <laughs> I was going to make you choose one, but you seem like such a nice guy. Schoolboy or fool boy? Schoolboy. Schoolboy, of course. And finally, shoot hoops with pick boy or the cow? 
The cow, she a female. The cow, the cow, shoot hoops with the cow. I'm a wing. Get in here, cow. Here we go. Here we go. Here you go. Shoot hoops. Behind the three-point line. Here you go, cow. Right there. Go ahead, cow. Oh, I'm the re I, I get the rebound. Here you go, cow. Here's Billy on parents on you big line. Did you miss it? Oh! Oh, my mercy! Another awkward moment at You Pick Live. Hi, Brent. Here's your coffee. Oh, thanks. You're welcome. Whoa! Snowing outside again, huh? Uh, no, actually, it's not. No, why? Well, because you got snow all in your hair there. Uh, that's not snow. I have a, um, a dandruff problem. Oh. I'm sorry. You know, they have shampoos for that and stuff. Ooh, so I guess that's not snow in my coffee. This has been another... What's up? All right, and right now it's time to find out the winner of today's Nick.com pick. Now, the gang at home has been voting all day between SpongeBob, Cat Dog, and Rocket Power. You see my hands? That's my, that's my hosting <laughs> stuff. Will you do us the honors, Murphy? Uh, show us the winner, Uncle Plasma, please. Please. Show us the winner, please. <laughs> it's SpongeBob. I'm so happy. I think I expressed my joy with a little rap for you all. Oh. I like SpongeBob. He's not a uh, rub uh, 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 uh. Let's he just watch the Nick.com pick. Oh, another reason to watch you pick live. Reason number 472, Candace has an eye on the back of her head. I don't normally use it. It needs glasses or a glass. Yeah? Whoa. That's cool, though. That is cool. I you like think it. so? Yeah, I like Yeah, it. I love the color, too, Candace. Thank you. You yeah. know, I'm usually a little self-conscious about it, but you guys really like it? Totally. Everyone should have an eye on the back of their head. I saw that. What? 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 I didn't do anything. This has been another reason to watch You Pick Live. Way. Do you have too much to do? Do you need to learn how to say no? Well, then we can help. Sign up for slacker school and learn the art of slacking. The <laughs> art of slacking? Yeah, right. Yeah, we'll teach you how to relax, to be cool, and to say whatever. whatever. Just like that, see? You don't have to care about anything. Why waste your energy, the dude? Slacker school sounds great. Yeah, it totally is. Have a seat. Put your feet up. Take the phone off the hook. You'll be responsibility free in no time, dude. Hey, thanks, Slacker School. Whatever. Whatever. Yeah. To enroll in Slacker School, call 555-555-SLACK. When you stop coming to class, we'll know you graduated. Yes, you're watching You Pick Live, and we're about to get crazy with the prize wall, all right? You uh, know it, Murphy. It is stacked. Contract coming your way. Top to bottom, you. with 14 to 5 8 stores, there's plenty of prizes, including the bucket of bucks, which is currently worth $147.49. Now, one very lucky lounger will be chosen to pick a door and receive a very special prize. And here to do the picking, the one, the only, Oh, Pick Hey, remember, you ever need a uh, superhero uh, rapper on your album? Huh? Give me a call, I. You'll be the first one not to call. <laughs> oh, yeah! Wow! <laughs> he took that as a yes, dude, trust uh, hey. me. He took that as a yes. <laughs> Who wants to go to the prize wall? Hi, what's your name? Robbie. All right, Robbie, which door do you want? Four. 
Door number four, pick boy. Careful there, pick boy. Door number four, right behind door number four. Whoa! You've won a You Pick Live backpack! Coming. I appreciate y'all really? having me. Man. Can you can That's you stick cool. around for one more segment? Um, yeah, I think I can. Wow, what a nice guy. That's good because you're gonna have to be a referee for the daily challenge today. Wait, wait, a referee for what? Because I'm gonna kick your butt in sumo wrestling, buddy. <laughs> yeah, well, we will see about that, Bring, Bring it. Oh, it's Ethan Barron. Yo, it's Thank you. you. Yo, save it for the daily challenge, man. It's coming yeah. up next. I own you. I own you. Get your hands off. Don't touch. for your amusement. That's right, it's time for the Daily Challenge. Yeah. Thanks to a post from Diametic at Nick.com. I don't know what that is. Uh, we're going to sumo wrestle each other wearing these diapers, and uh, Murphy Lee is going to be the referee. Yeah, but that's not all, Brent. Um, right, the fans yeah. at home have been voting all day on which ingredient will go inside of our diapers, either uh, beef stew, ice cubes, or gummy worms. Yes, as if the diapers alone weren't embarrassing enough. Yeah. Can we have the winner, please? Uncle Plasma! Let's see the winner. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Great! Great! Isn't that perfect? It's beef it's a tie. stew. That's just perfect. Beef stew and ice, ice cubes. cubes. All right, bring it on. Let's get the beef stew and the cubes in there. Okay, go ahead. What are the rules? The first person out the ring loses. Okay, that's it? Yeah, yeah. Okay, you ready? Now we start One, this. two, three, wrap. Go no hands, no arms. See, here we go. Live charades is coming up. I'll give you a hint. Brent is awesome. Six six eight. What's up, pickers? Antonio asked me to fill in for today's Nick.com charades. And now, if you tuned in the Nick.com cam around 3:30, 2:30 Central, you saw me doing a mystery action. Let's take a look at this. I was either eating spaghetti, taking pictures, or ice skating. If you guessed taking pictures and logged on to nick.com to throw in your answer, you got some major nick.com points coming your way. Great job, dudes and dudettes. Now, keep going to nick.com to log in all your votes for all you pick stuff, because every vote counts. Let's take a look at this self-portrait. Three, two, one. Oh, that's a nice shot. Christmas card material. From the message board. A poem about you pick live. By Cancer QT8. Candace is pretty. Brent is cute. They will dress in anything. From a chicken costume to a business suit. We love them all so, so much. When our school day is bitter. They always add the perfect touch. From laughing until you almost pee in your pants. <laughs> to doing something crazy like doing a dance. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, they uplift us from our school day drag. No matter how far our mass mouse <laughs> may frown with a sag. Asking us questions and reading them too. I know for a fact there is nothing they cannot do. True, true. They make us laugh and make us smile. Even if the show is over, we will continue to laugh for a while. <laughs> I always look forward to You Pick Live. Without you, I don't think I could survive. I love You Pick dearly. I love the crew sincerely. 
The end. Yay! Thank we'll you. We back Dan with more you pick lives right yeah. after this. Come here, pig boy. Come, Come here. here. And now, ten, cent, ten scientific seconds with Brent. I have developed a rather controversial hypothesis, but only now have I the courage to come forth. Clouds look like cotton balls. This has been 10 Scientific Seconds with Brent. Hey, hey, it is almost time for... Head! Two! Head! Cut, cut! You, dude, your fro's getting in the way of my face, Candace. My fro? What about your fro? Your fro is out of control, bro. <laughs> well, at least I don't have a bozo fro. <laughs> oh, no, you didn't. I believe I did. Oh, what you no, gonna you do didn't. about it? What you gonna do about oh, it? They had to don't head it. Oh, 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 no! Right you pick live, baby! I, I don't believe this! Yeah. Oh, oh. Yeah. Ah. Watch out! Ah. Friends. That's right. It is all about the head-to-head -head picks, baby. As always, a winner is picked by you. We've got Hey Arnold in Arnold <laughs> in one corner and My Life as a Teenage Robot in the other. Yes, indeed. Who's gonna reign victorious? Let's check out to see who the champ is on Good Old Uncle Plasma. I'm not turning around. Oh, I can see. And it is My Life as a Teenage Robot. <sighs> well, that decides the winner of your head-to-head -head competition. But what about ours? Forehead to forehead. Let's go. <laughs> Ouch, I think my brain hurts. Oh, don't back out now just because I'm beating you. I never give up, Candace. <laughs> <laughs> hey! Oh, oh, oh. Uh, forehead to forehead. Sweet. Can I play? Grant? Ow. Did you give up? Yes. Okay, sure. I'm in. Oh. <laughs> right. Okay, let's go. One, two, three. Here's your head to head pick. Tune in again tomorrow yeah. for more picking. I think my brain hurts. <laughs> <laughs> She's a cheap.